Good morning guys, Sophie again. And today, I am doing school. And we're going to go to the barn, so yay. So excited, this is like the best day ever. And there's mom. Hi guys, good morning. Welcome to today. to arrive in the mail. It's a disco party! And when I ordered, all my things that I ordered have come except for one. Nothing. Nothing. I thought I heard the mailman. Oh, well, you oh. to play the snow! Anyway, uh, we are heading to the barn today because there's something wrong with Stella. There's a problem with Stella. There's a problem, a huge problem with Stella. And Sophie is insisting we go to the barn. Sophie, come and tell them what the problem with Stella is. Ever since like everybody's been riding Stella, she stopped bonding with me. So we have to go to the barn so Sophie can bond with my man. Yeah. So basically, she's worried that she feels like Stella hasn't isn't as bonded with her as she is with other people, and so we have to go and get Sophie has to bond with her. So that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing today. Okay, so Gabby is doing um, a fraction still. She's still working on her fraction unit. And what do you have to do today, Gabby? I don't know. She has to add and subtract fractions with unlike denominators. And so... Um, Mom doesn't know. Does yeah, know I, I do. I remember how to do it. I said to her before she opened her book, I'm like, wait, you're going to get to something harder. And it's when the denominators aren't the same. And it's where you have to find a common denominator and... Um, and then simplify and I remember learning that I think it was like grade four I'm wearing my stormy night shoes. it was the first year I got glasses and I got them in grade four so I'm pretty sure that's when I started learning it and yeah it's not fun hi handsome yeah. I know he's coming for my phone come here guys it's a glowy thing and it's weird. Uh, I'm going to show you one of Levi's tricks later yeah we're today. gonna I'm gonna show them right in a minute you guys Levi's been learning some tricks so the thing that I bought him for Christmas is like it's something for him to do tricks with He's like, you like, no. Look oh, that feels good. Who bites yeah. you? Yeah, so he does bite sometimes. When he doesn't want to get picked up, this is what he does. Yeah. Aw. Hey. But he doesn't usually bite really hard. Don't leave your oh, finger no. there. <laughs> he doesn't it's usually the... bite like really hard. He doesn't get in a rage. Then, yeah, he will then, bite then, when then, he doesn't know what's happening. He will bite when we move too fast. That kind of thing. Or when he moves too fast. <laughs> okay, so let's finish your work so that we can show them the trick. Do you guys want to see uh, Levi's new trick? It's super cool. We worked on it just yesterday. Okay, so I have Levi here. And the purpose of the trick is for him to pick these up and put them in the cup. Levi, Levi, don't go. Look, look, Levi. Oh, I have a treat for you. Oh, wait, remember? Remember what you have to do? No, you have to put it in the cup first, remember? Good boy. Good boy. All right, let's see. It takes him a while to eat his treat. He's not like a regular bird. Levi, look. Put it, look. Put it in the cup. Put it in the cup. Good boy. All right, watch. Levi, look, look. Come on. Put it in the cup. Clean up. Good boy. We're teaching him. Good boy. Watch, Levi. <laughs> How fast was that? Oh, now he's gonna take it out. <laughs> oh, he's got two. <laughs> Clean up. <laughs> Boy! <laughs> and then he comes right to me for the treat. <laughs> he pretty much taught himself that. <laughs> Put it in the cup. Levi. Good boy. Good boy. I this morning. All right, Sam. You guys know how every day we wake up and there is an edit of us. Somebody always makes an edit of somebody in our family. Well, day by day, Storm and Stella 
made a, a, uh, a made a video of you. It's your first video. Remember that day? I don't remember it at all. <laughs> He's like, what? I never rode a horse. Funny. Isn't that nice though? <laughs> Look at those eyes. Funny. Anyway, the one time you'll ever see Sam on a horse and she got it, she had a, she made an edit and so it's so super cool because he doesn't really go on to our videos very much because he's usually at work. Um, but it is super fun when people um, include him. Anyway, we are headed out to the barn. Let's go rescue Stella and Sophie's relationship. First, I'm first one, I'm first one in the car. Girls are still getting all their stuff ready at the last second. And Gabby's like, let's introduce our dog to our horses. So, Is dad coming? No, dad's not coming. Dad's gonna go and to the doctor. Just him as a doctor's appointment. When we go to the barn though, literally it's like just relaxing. Like even though it's a lot of work, it's just like, I don't know, when you're around horses, you just get this deep breath and it just calms you down so much. But anyway. So tell us going to eat day one till day 12. So are you actually really worried that Stella's not bonding with you? Yeah, because everyone's been riding her. I feel like Stella needs to bond with all of us hey, though. Hey, we need a knife. It's okay. Gab's oh my gosh. What the heck? What are you doing? So Macy, you're gonna go meet the horses. No, Macy has met Storm. Yeah, they did meet before. Oh, oh. All right. We, oh, oh, you're gonna oh, put her oh, in your oh, backpack. Oh. Yeah, that's that's great. All right, you let's go. A sweater Did you bring her. a leash? No. Okay. Uh, no. That moment when you're just about to leave and you realize you have bird poop on your leg. Yeah, that's awesome. Thanks, Levi. Mom, can I bring cookies? Disgusting. It is beautiful outside. It's I think plus one degrees. And. <laughs> you think it's plus one degrees? Where's the baby carrot? <laughs> Gabby brought her horse. Yeah. Gabby brought her Kevin. dog. See the barn. <laughs> and her dog is like, Whoa, what's happening? She's like a little mouse squishing her nose. Gabby, I, I don't know if you guys Oh I don't know if you guys are like bored with the part where we show if our horses come. Um but I can't stop vlogging it because Because I love watching Storm come to Gabby. Like I, I wanna see it all the time. Like I just I don't know, it just makes me happy. All the horses are just hanging out though. It's a quiet day in the farm. <laughs> Except for there's Mimi. Is that Mimi? No, nope, that's Stella's friend. Oh, that's Stella's Mimi's friend. behind the shelter. Oh, okay. Stella. Wait, there's Mimi. Oh, there's Storm. Even though he's in blue. I hate him in blue. He knows that we're here though. There's Mimi. <laughs> she probably has a beautiful name. Beautiful name, not called Mimi. The rule was Gabby was not gonna take Macy into the field, but we all have so many things in her hand that she's the only one who could carry her because she has a backpack. And he's, what? Call him. He's like, I'm not having another lesson with race car driver because he worked me too long. Can't believe he's going away. Yeah, we're not gonna ride you, Storm. He's like really taking off, you guys. That's 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 the saddest thing on earth. Is that Stella's friend? She is a pretty girl. Oh, you are pretty. Before, when I didn't really know horses or really like them that much, I only liked certain looks. But now I'm seeing the beauty in all horses. <laughs> okay. Oh, and he did a turn. He did a turn. In our finest Walking the walk Ooh, Imagine what we could do Happy days be our guests Happy days manifest Let's stand together Put a smile on our faces Fill us up with your grace and make us
are nice, Mama. She told Stella, take it slow as you need to, Stella. Oh, you're here because there's grass. There's hay. Yeah. Sorry, Ma. Sorry, friend. Fun. Can you please open the gate? I got no hands. I got a horse. Hi, Stella Bella. I like it that she's clean. When it's oh. cold out, at least they're clean. Somebody said, give them a treat always when they come to the gate, even if you have to bring them to the gate, and we do. Okay, come on. Get your coat, Missy. Guys, you know, my mare is just so clean that she can hold on. She's to so clothes. good. She's my so mare. good. I told Sophie, Sophie. Yeah, walk on. Sophie, you need to canter Stella because she heard this. Oh, oh, she's a, she guys, smells this. Guys, look, she's my dresser. She's Sophie just needs to canter her because the Gabby and I had the same exact issue. We were both afraid and we needed to see what would happen if she went fast with us guys, see how and see that we can is? handle it. She can even carry my coat. Oh, my hand is frozen. I got day three. I got day three. Let's go give it to her. I haven't got day three yet. All right, let's see, Does our, do our horses like the chocolates? Do you like chocolate? Oh, chocolate. Huh, it's the first mm -hmm. treat she hasn't gobbled up. This way. Like do you like it? Wait, you wanna eat the whole thing? No, he, she shouldn't have too many at a time. I know, I'm just giving her one more. Okay, Storm, this is chocolate. I love it, he loves it. <laughs> You know what storm is so picky. Who doesn't like chocolate, right? He's like, thank you. Oh, what? He didn't even bite it. All that chewing and there was not even any bite. Pick it up and give it to him again. Storm. Stella will eat it. Stormy. He ate it the first time. Here, bite. I don't think he likes it. Gave it to him, bro. Here you go. Eat it. Do you like them? <laughs> you dropped one, but I don't know. You'll eat them. Do you think he's just like not hungry, so if, he doesn't eat like a lot of other stuff? Mom, if he doesn't like it, he won't take it. Imagine what we would do. Happy days be our guests. Lots of stretches. She's like so good with stretches. She just goes. Today I read a comment and it said that we put ourselves out there and we ask for advice. So everybody's entitled to give whatever advice they want. And they don't have to sugarcoat it. They can say whatever they want. And then she proceeded to say how out of shape and overweight we are and how it um, badly affects our riding. But she didn't say it so nice. <laughs> and I just wanted to say that it doesn't really, uh, yeah, we put ourselves out there and we do ask for advice. We don't ask for advice about our weight. Um, and there's never ever a time when you should say mean things pe about people or judge them in a negative way. Um, suggesting and helping, telling things that you do, um, saying things that work for you, that's totally different. But um, saying that we put ourselves out there so we get what we deserve is totally uncalled for, totally inappropriate. And the problem in that scenario 
is not us. It's the person leaving the comment. Never is it okay to body shame someone. Never. It's not okay to be racist. It's not okay to judge people based on their religion or their body or their height or it, it's just not okay no matter what and i just want to put that out there in case other people are feeling the same way that if we expose ourselves to the world it means that um we get what we uh, we have to take what we get that's not true it's not true at all it takes a lot of strength and courage to put ourselves out there every single day and i love it and i never want to change it and i always want to keep being me even if it means we get comments like that but i just want everybody to know that when people say things like that to you it is a problem with them not with you um so yeah storm's leaving i love the way he just saunters Uh-oh, it might actually happen. Just leave him. It might happen. It might happen. Uh-oh, he's not dumb. He knows where the truth are. <laughs> oh my god. Jump that thing, we're in trouble. Uh-oh. She called him and he's going. Like, what the heck? Oh, no, he's not. <laughs> he's coming to me. Hi, handsome. She just wants to play with you today. Look, I got the puppy. <laughs> he's like, you know how you know how you call your kid and you, or you say to your kid, go put this in your room right now, and then they don't listen, and then you say, get upstairs right now. That's what he's like. He waits till they get upstairs right now, bit, and then he does what he's supposed to do. I love that my kids have the opportunity to go and play with their horses. I know that you're curious, I know that you're strong, but life can be furious and things can go wrong. You go, you go. So, um, back when Storm was having trouble and he was like not jumping very well, I think it had more to do with his feet than anything. His feet are healing up and he seems to be back to normal. Stella's like, let me go. Go, we're better off tomorrow. But who knows, who knows if we get joy or sorrow. To the fire in your heart and your soul Don't trench your desiring What you can't control We fly, we fly Try so hard together And we might, we might Be lost but not forever Fresh. Yeah, they're a little fresh. There's things in life you simply need to know. But sun and rain and trust in letting go. It takes a bit of suffering. Ooh, good girl, Stella. Stella's getting better at that. Or you make it safely to the end. I thought you weren't gonna stop. Oh, she'll stop at you. Don't say you're ridiculous. You're not. Good boy. Look. Look. Oh, move her. Move her. Oh. <laughs> he's to and he's just like, nope. Not gonna happen, kid. Macy, you're fine. Yeah, it'll take Macy a while before <laughs> she... It takes it takes animals about a good month before they accept each other. We've had Ruby for over a year and a half and they still don't really accept her. There's things in life you simply need to know But sun and rain and trust in letting go It takes a bit of suffering Sleepless nights and wandering before you make it safely to the end, the end, the end. Don't say you're ridiculous, 
you're not even close Don't wish for indifference, you're not one of those We fall, we fall, but we always run I feel like Storm's jealous Come on, Basie! Come on! Come on! <laughs> Do you feel bonded a little more now? Yeah, kind of. Yeah, all right. They're not sure. Stella's scared. She's so scared. Focus. Yeah, Stella. Stella remembers. Good girl. Rain and trust in letting go. It takes a bit of suffering. Sleepless nights and wandering Before you make it safely to the end The end, the end Don't say you're ridiculous You're not even close Don't wish for indifference You're not one of those We fall, we fall You guys She's watching us go. She does love us. She's watching Gabby right now. She's like, are you coming in? But she does, she watches us. She watches us leave, she watches us come. Need to know But sun and rain and trust and let it go It takes a bit of suffering Sleepless nights and wandering Before you make it safely to the end The end Oh, there she is Bye, sweet Stella Bye, love Bye, Storm, love ya I think I she wants to, God, to come literally... When Gabby was playing with her dog Storm was losing his mind He was trying to run to Gabby I was holding on to his lead rope And he was trying to go to her And he was trying to jump the jump that guy <laughs> He's always at the bottom except for like Sundays when Lady's there. Um, but like that guy's the boss of the herd. He's the leader. That guy She's still is watching the us. Of all the horses. Now Storm's the okay, Gabby, we got it. Storm's the leader of all the horses. <laughs> She's got her mouth hanging oh, open. The leader of but look at look at look at Stella. She oh, she just turned away. She's still watching us. Storm might be the boss. <laughs> It takes a bit of suffering, sleepless nights and wandering Before you make it safely to the end, the end There's things in life you simply need to know But sun and rain and trust in letting go It takes a bit of suffering, sleepless nights and wandering Before you make it safely to the end before you make it safely to the end, the end, the end. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.